Hello and welcome to another Microsoft Word tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how you can record autocorrect entries. What autocorrect entries does, for example, sometimes when you misspell some commonly used words like this, it will automatically fix it for you. For example, if I'm writing a sentence, this. Notice, as soon as I misspelled this and I hit a space bar, it automatically fixed it, the, fixed the word this for me to the correct spelling. This actually comes from the autocorrect entries. Now, autocorrect entries can also be used for one more thing, and that is to convert abbreviation to the full form so that you don't have to sit there and type the abbreviation, uh, the, full the full form every time. So, for example, if I am typing a letter or a document or a research work in which I will going to be constantly using the word Microsoft. So instead of me sitting there and typing Microsoft every time I need Microsoft, what I will rather do is I will going to type MS. As soon as I hit a space bar, I would want it to be converted to Microsoft, which it is what which it is right now not doing. So let me take you to where you will going to go and fix the autocorrect. So let's click the file. And then we're going to go under Options. Right under Options, you will find there is an option called Proofing. You go under Proofing. And that's where you're going to find the autocorrect options. In the autocorrect options, we're going to go to the autocorrect tab. And this is exactly where you find a list of autocorrect options. So if you want a copyright symbol, you should put the letter C in the parentheses. Let's scroll down this list and you're going to find a lot of the words that you and I misspell and they're automatically converted to their actual form and it is because of the entry right over here in this list. So let me take you to the entry that is for the this. As you can see over here, generally people type THSI by mistake and it automatically gets converted to this. If this entry is not there, then that would not happen. Okay, so now let's say I want to have an entry for MS, which should automatically be converted to Microsoft. And I'm going to click Add. Now that is made as an entry in the autocorrect. I'm going to click OK, and another OK. So now I am here. Now let's test this. I'll type MS, and as soon as I hit the space bar, notice it converts it to Microsoft. Okay, if you are done with this research work and you want to remove this, you can certainly try it by going to File again, Options, Proofing, Autocorrect, and then you can go down in the list or you can simply type and replace with MS. It will jump to the item that matches in the list. You click on this item and you click delete. And that item is now removed. So let's click OK and OK two times. Now if you type MS and hit a space bar, nothing happens. So this is how you can use your autocorrect entries. Catch you in the next tutorial. 